our GAD dummy depositor. When the slurry was transferred from the cook station, then it will go to this inland mixer. Here below it is the oozing pump and also the uh, small tank for colors and flavors. So those flavors and colors and acid will be fed from the pump into the inland mixer with the slurry all together and then they will all fit into this copper. This copper is a 40 liter copper oil jacket copper that can keep the temperature for the slurry. So when do the depositing, the slurry will not get fewer in the hopper. This is the slurry level sensor. So when there is no uh, slurry inside of the hopper, this sensor will work and then it will stop depositing. Before they go into the depositing, it will be sprayed with the oil. It will help to demold the garment from the mold. So this is our control panel. So there is a Siemens 10-inch HMI panel with the emergency button and also a power switch. So this system was going to control all the parameters for the depositing, for the spring, for the temperature setting, as well as the demolding sections. So this is all the part that uh, was included into this white system. So now you can see here the hopper and hopper bottom manifold temperature setting. Also we have this uh, formula memory system. So you can actually input uh, more than 20 recipes into this system. And then you can storage and then you can call when you need it. And also this is the pages for the whole main operation pages. So let, let's try. So you can see the mold is dry. And then and then mold lift and deposit on. And this page can also show the demolding, the monitor and party speed and also the mold drive speed, all the stuff can be managed here.